Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's see what's down the grave now. Whoa. Uh -oh. Listen to the music. Zelda 1 reference. And maybe the royal crypt, but graves are creepy no matter who they are. Where are we supposed to go meet this King Gustav anyway? I'm not so sure I even want to anymore. Can't we just go somewhere less creepy? I thought he was not afraid at all. Anyway, new enemy right here. It is a Gibdo, and they attempt to grab onto you like so, which takes out a lot of... Whoops. Which takes off a lot of HP. And it's definitely a good idea to defeat them from a distance, if at all possible. Remote bombs. So, so handy. <laughs> And obviously you want to kill that one for a key if that wasn't blatant. Uh, okay, always look ahead to make sure... Uh, oh, geez, why did I grab the Gust Jar? There aren't any pots in the way. <sighs> Sometimes I swear. <laughs> oh! Beware. Those are mimics. They mimic doors. And... Go back up, Blint. Thank you. You can blow them up if you would like. <laughs> I love that. When they're partially down on the ground, they fly out like that with the chain and everything. Like, it's so stiff. Anyway, the middle door is the one that you want to go in. Alright, right here we have two keys and two little obstacle courses of sorts. So, I think you know what's going to happen here. <laughs> Alright, so let's get... The links multiply. Oh shoot! That was a little bit too far off the edge. Maybe the link, the solid link, should be the singular one on the left side, just so I have a little guiding spot there, so to speak. Oh no, nope. I'll take. Ah, oh, I was gonna say I'll take the hit, but that didn't work all that well. <laughs> Forgot how do I get around that trap? Actually, that. Could, oh wait, there we go. Ah, I get the idea now. And even the sound effects reference the first Zelda game. Anyway, now we go here, and we gotta do a similar thing only with a uh, moving platform. Uh, time it so that your last touch on the panel is when the moving platform is just about landed. Like, here is good. You just wanna have as much time as you possibly can so that you don't run out before you get to the other side. And there we go. Voila! And I think to get back, you can just like... Yep. That's what I thought. So... Boop! Boop! Ooh, oh, <laughs> Triple rope attack! That was kind of mean, because that was, that was a single hallway. You know, it was a single square hallway, and they're a really fast enemy to react to. Alright, let's light the torches. Oh, jeez! Oh, no! What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I got the remote bombs. This is extremely easy with remote bombs. <laughs> I just want to get its attention. There we go. You gotta get it to run towards you in order to take advantage of the remote bombs like that. Because then you just keep pushing it back with the bombs. Ooh. Mystical music. Triforce pots. Familiar symbols on the ground. Where might we be? Well, okay, we're at a crypt, but <laughs> I don't know, I was just trying to be dramatic, I suppose. Dot dot dot, dot dot dot. Oh, young one. Child who seeks to rescue my descendant, Zelda. Welcome. My name is Gustav. I was king of Hyrule countless ages ago. I grant you this kinstone. Seek the source of the flow in Hyrule. Only then will your path open. Save Zelda. All of Hyrule is counting on you. Yeah. And once again, it's another golden or yellow kinstone piece. That's a very special event kinstone piece. Yeah. Fascinating. An ancient king of Hyrule. How strange. And the source of the flow? What do you suppose that could mean? Uh... 
being warped out. I was gonna say, is there anything else on that tablet? I guess we'll never know. So let's go and take a look at the kinstone piece because it's one of a kind. It looks like that. Have we ever seen a kinstone piece that could match that or a spot that could match that? Why, yes we have, but where might it be? Who knows? Who knows? I do know, however, that there are a couple of kinstone fusions that I can do over here. Left, 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 up, up, up. Dang, what's that last turn? Hmm, he's hinting at something, isn't he? But first, let's fuse some kinstones. And this should open up a grave that we couldn't push open before. Yeah, which one, though? That one? Huh. Oh, spooky, it moved on its own. Huh? They fit. Uh, let's just see for the heck of it if there's gonna be any more. Yes! Yes, in the diddly doo. Uh, both Dampe, uh, Dampe here and the uh, uh, Spookter over there have a couple of fusion that, fusions actually. And that makes a hole up here at the Wind Ruins. I know, I mean, I'm sure you know where that spot is. Oh, well, they fit. Same dialogue, same copy pasta. Got any more? No, you don't. I have worn you out of kinstones. You are now kinstoneless. Let's do this, Spookter. Let's do it. And, oh, this is when that ghost moves out of the way. That sounded like a boo, by the way. I don't know why I've been such a nasty little prankster all the time. All of a sudden, I feel like a weight's been lift off my shoulders. I feel like I've made up for all my awful deeds. Haha! <laughs> hey, Spookter, see you in paradise! Ah, I was doing it. And I'm guessing he's hinting that he went to heaven or something like that. They fit perfectly. I have a good feeling about this. Um, do you have anything else to say? Mm, same thing. Okay, let's reset the area. And you have another fusion, right? No, you don't have another fusion. Interesting. I thought you would have another fusion, but anyway, let's go in here. Maybe this is the ghost that has more fusions. Look at this! <laughs> First, let's steal her mysterious shells. Ah, so you've moved that gravestone and now you can go outside. But I would get lonely here by myself, so could you come see me sometime? I have plenty of kinstone pieces ready, so please do come back. Let's do this. This is Gina the ghost. And let's see what this fusion does. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yep. Even some waterfalls can have holes behind them after a kinstone fusion. They fit perfectly. Hmm. I hope some good luck comes our way. Uh, I think you have another fusion, so I'll be right back. Get that fusion ready. I'm coming back in. <laughs> yes, you do. Voila! And... Oh, this opens up the uh, uh, tree to that treasure chest back at the Trilby Highlands. Uh, okay, it's Western Woods, but it's south of Trilby Highlands, excuse me. Alright, let's see if there is one more kinstone fusion. I don't know. Probably not. No, okay. Alright, I'm going to see you at whatever I'm doing next. <laughs> How about we go back to Hyrule Town and fuse with the Element Girls. Yeah, remember those girls that give you charms? Let's fuse Kinstones with them because we are going to get really nice prizes from fusing with them. So... Okay, I just wanted to see if she had something else to say. I didn't think so. So... Fuse with her, and a little critter known as a Joy Butterfly will appear at the Flowery Patch at uh, the uh, Caster Wilds. There are three Joy Butterflies in all, and they upgrade your abilities further, so they definitely are very nice to get. Anyway, um, 
next one is... Uh, I think the inn is the closest one next, because the other one's at the far side. Gladly indeed. I hope you too get a Joy Butterfly out of this. They are just that fantastic. <laughs> and this is over at the Wind Ruins. I might pick up uh, those butterflies before the end of this part, actually, because I, I would really like to uh, upgrade my abilities for later. So maybe I'll focus on... Uh, because actually, this next Kinstone Fusion uh, will be the last Kinstone Fusion, and I'll have to move on with the game in order to do more Kinstone Fusions. So... You'll see what I mean, because the, the rest of the Kinstone Fusions are in the new area, basically, and there's no more Kinstone Fusions to be done at uh, this moment in time. So there's another Joy Butterfly. Alright, let's go fetch them, and that one's gonna be really annoying to go back to. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can figure out Dompe the Gravekeeper's puzzle here. Left. Left. Oh, no, you don't. Left. Up. 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 And now the last... Oh. Oh. Well. <laughs> He said he doesn't remember the last direction, but I got a prize for doing left, 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 up, up, off. So, so does that mean there's one more direction that I could go? Mm, I'm not sure. Let me do that sequence one more time until I get to the chest. Alright, this time I'm going to try another up. Well, it led me back here, so I... <laughs> That isn't the usual sequence on how to get out of here, but, mm, well, eh, ah, whatever. <laughs> and, hello, Joy Butterfly. And now I can swim faster than before, and I'll demonstrate that to you when I get the opportunity to. Okay, here I am back at the chest again. Let's try right this time. And it led me back to the beginning. Okay, my last... Last direction, I suppose, is uh, to try going down. So, I guess this would be the successful run, if anything, for this this time, because I know that this is the route, unless uh, going up was indeed the correct last direction that uh, Dampe was talking about that he couldn't remember. Yep, this just takes me back out, so it, it doesn't go any further than the path Dompe said, aside from just going up to where he was from that point forward. Anyway, so let's go fly over to the Caster Wills. And yes. I'll probably get the one south because it's the... Well, actually this one's not too far away either. Get out of my way. Ah, I don't, even, I don't even know how to manage to nick me there. Oh, where is... That must be more centered out poopers. I need to go... I use the boulder. Ah, I should have went for the other one first, like my instinct told me. Arrgh. Let's just do this one. <laughs> so here's a joy butterfly down here. Grab it, and I can shoot arrows faster than before. Uh, let's test that. Oh yeah! Wait! Oh, I wanted to shoot something just because I could. Alright, so... Let's go back across, and... Oh, why didn't I think I could swim across the water? I have flippers now. I derped. <laughs> That's my only explanation. Anyway, I gotta show you what the improved swimming looks like. And I can also now dig faster than before. So, you know what would be a good place to do all of this? This way. <laughs> Remember the places that I was just at? Oh, and as long as I'm uh, taking this path back, might as well also grab this... <sighs> grab this prize along the way back on your mysterious shells. Mm, oh no, you don't. Oh, my roll spin thingy actually came in handy. I'm surprised. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. Faster swimming! 
Let's see our faster digging. This is really fast. It's, it's a really noticeable difference. <laughs> Hyper digging! Yeah. And with that, I think I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.